Hi guys, welcome back to the Banner Saga, or welcome to my channel if you're new. My name is Vivi. So, um, last time we had a disastrous fight and it annoyed me so much because I figured I could have done much better. So I loaded up the game today and I picked the last save and when we got to that fight it turned out much better we even got a couple of promotions mm, let's see um, Hawkon and Gunnar got their promotion so uh, that was a better fight and I'm happy I did that because I realized I had to place my shield master a bit wiser so that's probably why when I just realized he's got the lowest armor I think of them all well I mean of the ones that needs to be up front so yeah, I guess the Warhawks are built that way. But anyway, I didn't want to start this game up again today without... To, to make it fun again, is what I'm saying. I don't, I don't care about losing, but if I don't... If there's no learning involved, then uh, it's pointless. So, yeah, let's just get going, shall we? You overhear a conversation while marching alongside the warriors. I'm happy to stomp some slag as much as the next ball, but I didn't join up to take orders from Hawkum, says one. Apparently, he doesn't realize you're within earshot. Not willing to die for him either. All right, let's just uh, walk on by. <laughs> Not sure Vugnir would have been happy to hear that, you growl loudly. The Varl flinches as you walk past without looking his direction. In the distance, you can hear his friend laughing at his misfortune. <laughs> I guess we need to make a name for ourselves. A small gathering of tents come into view group of merchants from the look of it. You ask what they're doing here. We were camped out at the godstone ahead, one tells you, leaving an offering to Denglid, as one does. His expression turns. Drage start appearing out of nowhere. Some of us stayed, thought the godstone would be safe, but damned if I know why. We've been dodging them since we left. Uh... Yeah, we, uh, I think it's clear. They thank you profusely. Wait, should, should we have traded with them? We can't do that now. Okay, fine. One stops as he passes. If you're passing by Dinglid, do me a favor. My wife's brother stayed behind. You'll know him by a necklace with many rings on it. If you see him, say we are safely in Strand. You nod. After a short time, they continue on. Well, you're not safely in Strand, but I, I get the sentiment. <laughs> oh. Was that Strand we could see in the distance there? The caravan slows unexpectedly. Word travels down the line. And then Mugir, who tells you, Dredge know we're coming, probably saw us back at Lederfeld and did the usual lurking. Could have been bad if we'd blooded into them, but we saw them first. Dredge watch you, waiting to see what you do. When's the last time you commanded a few hundred Hokon? asks Mogir. Don't overthink it. The warriors can take care of themselves. 
war. Okay. When you when you come across more enemies than your party can handle, you'll engage in war. Give your army orders to fit the situation, but be prepared to get your own hands dirty too. By making battle easier for yourself, you'll end up with higher casualties. Or you can take burden on yourself with a harder battle, but save more lives. If you're ever desperately outnumbered, it may be best to run. Avoiding battle completely. Alright. Trench line the battlefield, weapons drawn, a fight seems inevitable. You take a quick head count. There must be at least 475 of them. You have 185 fighters and 466 ball at your side. Should be okay, right? Oh, wait a second. What's this? Uh, it says, even from here you can see nervous glances amidst the enemy ranks. This looks like a good chance to press your advantage, but I don't really... What's the difference between charge and formations? Aren't you gonna charge? Yes, you probably are, but I... I am, yeah. Hold them off, retreat. It's just different tactics for the battle, right? I want to see how it works. You consider taking your trusted allies and leading the charge, battering down the enemy. It will throw you into the thick of battle where fighting is most dangerous, but a strong charge can save lives. Yeah, <laughs> rush into battle. Let's let's rush, okay? <laughs> Okay, this is probably a mistake. Alright, so if we stay up here with the toughest guys, let's see, these two, well, at least him. And I'm not so happy about that because every one of these are gonna be able to to uh, hammer on him and make sure he's not the one they're attacking first okay hopefully wait oh god I forgot to put him up but well actually I'll just let him stay there for now let them come to us oh god how many Eight. Well, and this one is the biggest problem. Yeah. Let, let them come to us. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's a bad idea. They're sort of lining up to get us all in one schmack. <laughs> well, There we go. Oh yeah, that's right. Maybe I should have... Hang on. She's got... Slag and burn. Trap an area laying down coals which do one strength damage. Oh. In a five tile area. Including the one you put it in. So... Maybe not there? I could... Do it there. Can I? Oh no, I can't. I can't reach, can I? Are you kidding me? Ugh, she needs to move up one then. Okay. Let's move you up there. Now. See how this works. Oh yeah. Yeah. Not too bad. Ugh, this is a problem. Oh, oh, wait a second, wait a second. Are we gonna... Yeah, we are definitely gonna hurt. So that's not a good idea. Well, you're strong and you can 
deal a lot of damage, so do that. Oh, yeah, let's just pummel him. Almost down. Got two of these big guys, though. Yeah, he's a bit stronger. So, uh, if we move up, are we gonna hurt? No, that's not burning. That's just ash, right? But, alright. Yeah, we're good. Bring the pain or attack. I'm just gonna see. Um, well, let's do that. Yeah, let's do that. I'll, I'll take my chances. Tempest, um, that's gonna hurt for uh, the wrong people. Yeah, well, he's going down. Right, can you put down an arrow? No, you can't. Why not? Oh. I guess you could move a bit. It's a bit scary, though. Oh, there's a lot of them over there as well. If I move you over there, about well, that, but all right, put her here because they can't reach her that easily, right? Let's see, is it possible to put it down there? No. All right, well, there, that's gonna hurt a couple of them, right? Yeah. Ah. Hmm, I feel like I need to have him get up here and fight a bit. Yeah, let's try this. Yeah, well, a bit. So, problem is, he has now closed off, so this guy won't go over there. Meaning he's gonna pummel Gunnerf. So, and he's already hurting. <laughs> okay, can you give him a, a little bit of rallying? There we go. Look, look. Oh. Yeah. That's... Okay, fine. Five. Yeah, can you put down one of those arrows in... That's perfect, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Yep. Oh god, he's... Seriously? Seriously? I can't for the life of me get him to last more than every other battle. <laughs> cool, he deflected. So, he's got so many, he needs to decide who to fight here. Wait. Oh, yeah, okay. There. Perfect. Now, can you go up and do some damage to bring the pain. I'm not even sure it's that good. Honestly. One more arrow. Yeah. Uh, it needs to be there, I think. Couldn't burn him down, I think. Oh no, oh no. Are you kidding me? That's what I was afraid of. I'm gonna have him go up and say hello. 
Can you do one more damage? You can. There we go. And... Okay. There's no point in him trying to move up there. Or is it this way? Nah, let's just go in and get one of them down. Just because it's the only th one we can take. And a promotion. Oh god, he's... <laughs> he is hurting. Yeah, he is. Let's see. Wait a second. Bring the pain. That's it. Oh um, yeah, it's full. Now, can you go up and, and do some damage? Please. Four. Well. How about six? He can't reach. Fine. Put it on. Oh, go. And you go. Can you? Yeah, I can. It's gonna. It's gonna hurt him a bit, though. But oh, he's almost down. That's that's cool. Yeah, yeah. I know. I know. <laughs> that's a bit painful. You take a moment to survey the battlefield. The enemy is being pushed back all the way down the line. You could take this opportunity to pull back and leave combat immediately. On the other hand, chasing down more dredge would rally your fighters and save a few lives. You won't have time to rest or change your party. No. Wish we're... I don't see that happening. Nope. <laughs> Not this time. Maybe next time. Another. Maybe another day. Yeah. Oh. We didn't lose any people. Just us hurting a bit. Cool. That's my, that was my plan all along. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, I just figured out I can hit the camp icon and not having to walk into another trap, another fight. So, let's rest up. Alright, back on the road again. Yeah, that's drum down there, I'm pretty sure. Uh-oh. Something's going on over there. Oh. Ludin has been sending scouts ahead. Quicker and more nimble than your wall. One rushes back just as you cross the hilltop. Out of breath. Dredge! That direction. You overhear him tell Ludin. About a day away, they found a village. You ask what they're doing. Tearing the place apart, he says. Maybe a thousand of them, or more. Looking for gods know what, Ludin is uncharacteristically silent, waiting to see what you say. Um, yeah, and um, what are we gonna say? <laughs> Draw some of them forward and split them, or uh, get closer? No, that's probably, they're gonna see us. Wait and see. Nah, let's split them up. You send a small group of shield bangers to get their attention. They do. Half a day later, many dredge are giving chase up the hill in their plodding sort of way. You get ready to lay waste. Oh. Oh, I'm happy we can't. So, 521 of them. We, There's more of us. So this is the same. Let's try and see what happens with formations. You start comparing weaknesses and strengths, taking into account terrain, morale, and the look of your enemy. If you're careful, you should be able to keep your forces balanced. Keep the order. 
I'm not even sure what order I gave, but fine. Formations? How? <laughs> okay. You start rallying your forces and gather your allies to you, preparing to enter the fray. Let's see how this looks, if it's any difference. Okay, we've got five of them. Oh, and they're so spread out. Um, let's get to a corner, shall we? And I'm gonna have him stay up here and Hokun where I'm just I'm just gonna put them let's see to protect her oh and Eirik as well yeah um he is sort of a fighter as well so maybe I shouldn't put him too far be yeah let's try that and yeah, you. <laughs> Wait a second. I'm gonna... Alright, fine. Let's do it. It's not gonna help, is it? If I put him there, he's gonna... Well, at least that's gonna be one to deal with, not ten. Oh, well, five. <laughs> okay, let's see how this works. He can move up to this guy. I think let's do that just to start the fight with the shield master. Um, bring the pain. Yeah. Look, he's. <laughs> yeah, that's laughable. Why the hell would they always go for this guy? And I can't reach them. So, what to do? Move up or... I think I'll move a bit this way. No, no, no. And protect our flaming arrow girl. Alright, you can you can do a lot of damage on this guy so do that Boom. yeah oh no <laughs> of course wow seriously um tempest it's not gonna not gonna do much though but fine yeah nothing at all I mean, one strength damage. So, that's not a good idea. What can you do though? You can do one strength damage. Now, you're gonna have to hurt a bit. <laughs> do we want to do that? I mean, um,. I think we need to do that because he is in trouble actually. Yeah. Sorry, Hokon, it's gonna hurt a bit. But you're good. Uh you're fine. Let's see, can you oh, he's got a bit of armor, but Yeah, not bad. Oh, he's fine. The other coal burned out so quickly, so I'm not sure. Yeah, you can take him out. But he's not that much of a danger, I think. Go up there and get this one. Yeah, he should be able to do something. Wait, actually, that's a problem. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, okay, well, we're fine. <clears throat> So do we want him to get that promotion? I'm not sure he can. But this guy needs one as well. So, fine. Oh, 
Oh, he didn't get one. You take a moment to survey the battlefield. The enemy is being pushed back all the way down the line. Oh no. Uh, how's... No. A shield master is not doing good. So... No, let's not do that. I'll feel braver another time. <laughs> Wait, we lost fighters and Varl? Oh no. Why? Because we weren't pushy enough? I don't know. But okay. Yeah, that's war for you. Actually, I'm gonna take a break before anything else happens. So, rest up and then next time we will continue whatever was in the distance there, we will, we will find out. But for now, take care and thanks for watching.